Hello everyone and welcome back to Visions of Mana. Last time we made our way towards the mines in the desert to the southwest to try and find Gnome, the element of water of earth, so that he may bless the soil in Dead A Cliffs and allow our vine to grow all the way to the heavens. So we may reach Elusia Isle and fuss the manatee and confront Orin for his evil ways. Not the end of our journey. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what's going to happen today at all. But before doing anything, we're going to go into our menu. We're going to go to you. And we're going to be putting on... No, 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 not that one. The new Earth thing. Am I going to be using Earth in this fight? No, because I'm pretty sure Orin is also going to be Earth-based. Is he going to be the fight we're going to be doing? Yeah, probably not. We'll see. Oh, what's this? I like how it's like made out of gold. That's cool. That's a neat outfit. I, I don't know if they have no outfits where you're not, your not your top legs aren't exposed. Magus. Isn't someone else called Magus? No, okay. In tune of the element of Earth, uh, these magic users wield giant flails and conjure large boulders to squash their foes. So you get some box. I think I said I was going to put more points into this. My bond with the spirits virgins. I'm on the right track. Awesome. Keep it up. I didn't like your earth form, did I? Oh shit, I did it anyway. Fuck. Okay. Now in terms of gear, Welcome. do you have anything new for me? We do not. Again. To be fair, I don't think the gear here will be useful. Welcome. What will it be? Oh, saying that, never mind. Excellent choice. Thanks a bunch. No. Stop by again. And then finally the item store because at least there's some new ability seeds we can buy probably. Welcome. Singular Please, ability seed we can buy. Right. I don't think there's anything else we can do right now. I think we're just going to head up. Let's bring Palomina into the party. Oh, she's already in the party. Okay, good. Just to confirm, uh, you need a class. Moon. The best class that he has, probably. That's a cool shot. Alms. Soul Guard. Milos Woods lies just beyond the cliffs. Wait, we're it not going straight to the tree? God damn it, I thought we weren't. Within the forest, you will find Verdius Burrow, hidden home of the Sprout. No, you tricked me! I thought we were going straight to the tree of mana! If the Alm joins your party, you will be that much closer to the mana tree. You are well on your way to ensuring the... I think chapter five, I'm going to guess, is the mana tree. We're going to go there and sacrifice the arms and then it's going to not work out. Wait. Oh, can I go back after going in here? Yes. There's stuff we can do, but I'll hold off. A tiring trek it has been, but we have come far. It's all thanks it's to good the vine grew in a way where we could climb it. Ever since Guju, I've been thinking about how we take their powers for granted in our everyday lives. True, but with the own sacrifice, we can ensure that mana flows to the spirits of earth, fire, wind, water, the moon, and all the rest. 
I don't like streets. that though, Morley. I want you to live. Verdius should be in view once we reach beyond this road. The Alm may have already been appointed. We're gonna meet we'll our final character. Come across Orin or the Alm of Wood first. I, I don't know how Orin would have gotten up here, but sure. Brace yourselves, everybody. Maybe he used the vine. He was waiting for us to do it. That's it. Like the cut, like the evil mastermind of the years. Like every other Final Fantasy villain. I just followed you here, you idiot. Oh, what kind of trees are these? I've never seen anything like them. The plant life on top of the cliffs doesn't seem to suffer from the same issues as the ones below. I suppose all of Elusia Isle is isolated from the lands we know. Oh, fact, oh, I see. I so the mana tree the gets the tree its, its own machine. fucking store mana, but uh, everyone else has to suffer. Now. Okay, got it. More Leave reasons to, to hate the mana tree. We won't let Orin keep Hina's core stone. Grumpy cat. Milo's woods. I remember Milo from Ocarina of Time, the asshole. Okay, there's uh, there's multiple ways I can leave. Got it. Or it's because there aren't any people to keep the woods in check. Don't get lost, okay? I don't know if I'd be able to find anyone here. Uh, hello. What is this then, game? What is this then, game? Uh, what? what? Huh. What happened to that big flower? Might it feed on the mana power of monsters, perhaps? A balanced ecosystem between monster and plant. These woods are very interesting. It's so pretty. I remember the forest area from, uh... Trials of Mana, but this is like even more than that. It's so much more dense and populated. Oh! I quite like this class. Yeah, I like the flail. It's good. I might have just found a class I might be using for now on with Palomina. My father told me once that there's an herb that only grows in these woods. It's a highly <laughs> Oh god, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to sneeze Morley while you're talking. He sure does. I guess Earth might be useful here, considering that, I don't know, it's grass base? Is Earth good against grass in the, in the Mana series? I should really have a look to see if any elements will be the other elements in this series. <gasps> Earn at least 100,000 Luca in a total. I am now a millionaire. Or one could call me a Lucanaire. Oh, the flower's gone. I suppose it really was feeding off the nearby monsters. There might be more. Let's look around. Ah, so you want me to kill the flowers? Got it. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, very, I'll do it, of course. I will oblige. Secured. I don't know. I feel like when you pick up a gold clover, it should be worth five EP. Because they're not, they're not the easiest thing to find anyway, and not you don't really get enough. Whatever means. You just said that. Palomina, you just said that. I, will take this. I think he I don't think he's okay. <laughs> I think I'm okay playing this game. I'm having too much fun. Generally, like after finishing the last episode, I had to record the next one straight away because I was this interested in the plot. That was some jack stock. It just kept growing and growing. Did you really need to jump on my back though? Oh, a better view when you happen to be next to me so i've been demoted to platform he is a platform Let us ponder our next he's time. our platform though doesn't seem like he's that annoyed about it though <laughs> What the 
fuck? Submit! He, he's handsome! <laughs> Submit! The enemies and their corresponding flora have been conquered. Hmm. Which came first? The flower or the monster? I'm enjoying how playful everyone's getting. I have gathered some grizzly syrup. You have? I'm quite aware that you have gathered some grizzly syrup. <gasps> Big yeah. grizzly syrup! Yeah. Yeah. Did Orin already make it? Oh, that's a big one. It's weird that we have to meet each other even though we're heading toward the same place. There is but one road to Elusia Isle. It does not sound possible, let alone plausible. Unless he's following us. I love this move, this this uh, weapon. This weapon is fucking awesome. <laughs> This one's too big to get around. There may be a connection to the other curiously <gasps> large blossoms in the vicinity. Look, a cactus. I forgot to read the one from last time. I was so interested in the dungeon. I forgot. You always can't find a good hiding spot. The dub bears call these mines home. Here's how to say hello in dub bear. Dub! Bub 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 dub bub dub dub gat 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 dub gat Okay, I admit it. I don't really know any dub bear at all. Oh, I was kinda of hoping I can translate that. Whoa there, break it up! You're too close, much too close. You need to give each other space. If your leaves block the sun, the poor shrubs on the ground won't grow. What then? Oh oh. I didn't realise you were involved. Oh, how romantic! Oh, now I'm blushing. <laughs> the lives of some plants, I guess. You do kind of wonder what would happen if plants could actually speak. Especially in jungles. Would this be like a, like a, a plant version of Game of Thrones? Like everyone fighting for territory? I have not seen Game of Thrones yet. I have no idea if this is true. I say yeah. I'm not, I don't plan on watching it actually saying that. Considering how it ends, I rather watch TV that, that ends good. Even if the early content is, is good, I don't really want to be disappointed. There's plenty of content out there and fantasy shows that I could watch instead. And plenty of shows about sex in them too. But the sex is good, Flower! I don't care, I don't really watch TV shows for that sort of thing. It's something that 16 did too, and I was like sitting there like, okay, this is obviously just to have parallels with Game of Thrones, but it's not really adding anything. I, I would say with the Barbarica and uh, Hugo stuff it did, considering that is his whole arc in that game. But we did not need to see fucking Barnabas naked with his mum. That wasn't something I wanted to see ever in my life, and that is what happened. Boss fight? Boss fight? Boss fight? Boss fight. Okay. We done? We're done. That was the, the shortest area ever. <gasps> Excellent. This is a great situation we are in right now. You can have that. Uh, and you can have... I think first thing is actually really useful for you. Considering how much damage you already do with critical hit. Oh! Wait! I could have used that game. I didn't get a chance to read it though. Is this a settlement of some kind? Yeah, they said it was a village here. There don't appear to be any settlers. Even their plants. Excuse me! Is anyone here? What the fuck, Karina? Nope. Nothing. It doesn't look as bad off as Guju. 
we would know if disaster had struck another town. This looks pretty fine to me. Did you hear that? Sounds like music. Does Orin play the guitar? Calm down. It's probably just one of the citizens of Verdius. I believe that riveting refrain is coming from over there. <coughs> Shall we investigate? I love hearing Palomina say words like this. This words as they exist is always good from Palomina. There's gotta be someone around playing that song, right? Are they playing it right now? Is that what I'm hearing? Is it like music? Hmm. This bow is entirely populated with spoutlings. Come to think of it, not much is known about how the spoutlings live. Where are they? Hmm. Whatever instrument this mystery person is playing, I like it. Yes. This tranquility makes it feel as if time is transpiring slower than usual. That or my imagination is running away with me. Yes. Uh, probably both. Ooh. Okay, these are definitely the people that does pretend to be plants right now. Let me see. Is this? That's kind of cool. Take I've this. heard this song before. I don't know what, in what game, but I've definitely heard this song before. Let's rest up. The, the, the Deku Tree? That was over here? No, I can definitely it's hear this, the guitar. Here. Who is it? Why is the first thing we see fires? Always fires. Always the Mana series obsession with fires. Oh, she's a plant lady. I mean, we saw this. I've seen this character before on the poster. It's lovely. I'm glad that she doesn't speak like Charlotte. I was kind of worried that this character would do that. Looks like jam number 1460 is another keeper. Not bad, not bad. Gosh, what? the fairy is taking her sweet time this year. Those were some weird lyrics. I mean, weird lyrics, they were lovely. I really asked for your input. <laughs> Get out of town. You wouldn't happen to be the convoy of alms now, would you? They said uh, that first part really quietly. I'm Julie, custodian of the burrow, a sproutling, obviously. Oh, you came all this way, but I'm sorry to say there's no alm of wood just yet. I guess that means we're stuck here for now. Wait a second. One, two, three. Is it just me, or are we missing people? I really hope Due that you that guitar is, is, is has like cloven behind it. <laughs> I am Palomina, Alm of Water. Oh, uh, I'm the Soul Guard, Val. Morley, Alm of the Moon. They call me Karina, Alm of Wind, and this pretty lady is Rainco. Yeah, so pretty. Golly, a sacred beast cub, still growing, I see. Were you raised outside of Okay, so she's quite knowledgeable about the manatee and stuff then. Do you know Ramco? No, uh, he knows what Ramco is. No, we only just got acquainted. But I know plenty about these sacred beasts. That's everyone. Oh, what about the alm of fire? Uh, about Did that. something happen to the alm from Tianya? About that. She, uh, Hina. She lost her core stone. We're looking for the... Yeah, so if you don't know, this is, this is our fifth point member. Again, hurry. very late in the... In, not, 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 might not be late in, in terms of how far we are for the story, but considerably yeah, late in the others. Sounds like most people haven't heard of core stones. The only news I can give you is no news. Sorry. There's nobody here but us Sproutlings. And I haven't seen any thieves come through the burrow in, well, ever, probably. I like their voice. I thought they were going to be Charlotte, so but they're not Charlotte. Oh, yeah. And that boulder at the entrance.
entrance with the legendary sword stuck in it, but that's it. Huh? huh? Legendary sword? Oh. Oops. Look at the time. I have to go water my friends. Bye. But wait. <laughs> what sword was he talking about? Am I the only one in the dark here? The goddess of mana was said to have given. Could I use uh, they them the pronouns then? Because I wasn't but sure I at first. Never fathomed that the fairy tale was fact. Orin and Hina talked about it once. I didn't think it was Again, familiar. I really like the character designs in this. Perhaps the kernel of truth behind They're very untraditional for RPG characters. The home of the mana tree. Our search for Oren might be a bus. He's like oh, a, a annoyed little kid. We should ask that kid from earlier what's up. Karina, sure. you can't say that Let's kid, you're him. also a kid. I have no idea how old Karina is. She could be any age. She could be older than everyone else here or younger than everyone else here and I'd have no idea. He has to water his what? Better look for him, I guess. Oh, that bites. Huh? No arms been named yet. Same story, set different city. Do you think the other pilgrimages had this problem? I could hazard a guess, maybe. <laughs> Such a melodious piece of music. July's lyrical phrases were both fair and philosophical. I like all the little rabbits here. Wait, where's more? Where's Morley? There he is. Goliath mm. said that he was a custodian in the burrow. What does that entail? I don't know, but let's go find out. Why, yeah, why is everyone else, like, just, like, plants? I thought they would all wake up when, when, uh, Yuli talked, yes. but no, they're just still plants right now. Yeah, so I have, I have a fair bit of, of experience with another character like this called Charlotte. Charlotte is from Charles of Manor and her voice is terrible. She's the Iwu voice I've mentioned a couple of times before. Um, and I was worried that that would be this character but they didn't do that luckily. Same with Morley. He doesn't do the meow speak. So they've been doing a good job in that, in that respect. To be honest if they wanted to with Charles of Manor they could have made her speak normally but they didn't do that. They kept her Weird mannerisms, and I kind of respect that. I'm sort of in the middle of my daily duties. Mind getting out of my way? Do all custodians water the plants here? You have like a caterpillar tail? Of course. Who else? I have to take care of my friends. We're looking forward to seeing what your different outf outfits are going to sure. be, considering your your basic is design is kind of, of interesting. Wait, what? This tree is a sproutling? Oh, I guess you wouldn't know. When the sproutling goes to sleep for a long time, we tend to turn into trees. Every four years, just in time for the pilgrimage, one of my hibernating friends grows the most beautiful flowers. The alluring fragrance beckons the fairy to the burrow, and that lucky sproutling gets to be the own. So not you then. Considering you're on the box art, I think that's going to be you, but okay. Our patron elemental wants lush foliage on all of her envoys. But when are the buds meant to bloom? Usually the trees are already in bloom by the time the convoy of alms arrives. Oh. But not this year. There's probably no hope for the burl after all. I suppose we all gotta go sometime. <laughs> Boy, you can't just think of it's just gonna jump. Yeah, exactly. Nope. I think this is it for us. No flowers, no fairy, no future. No flowers, no fairy, no future. That might be the name of the episode. <laughs> really gonna give up on his homeland? Just like that? <laughs> How very silly. Knowledgeable about the pilgrimage. There's a lot more I want to ask him. I mean, it makes sense. He's he. He probably like talks in a mana tree. Is the mana tree talkable? No, there's like a goddess isn't there because if I remember from Charles of Mana, the pixie he was with us to our all, all our journey became the mana goddess in the end. Is this? Taking this? Hmm. I have read literature on the hibernation habits of sproutlings, but there is merit in meeting one in person. <sighs> Julie should watch out. Queen is in a mood. What do you mean Queen is in a mood? <gasps> I hate it when people give a bad fight. Oh no, she is angry. Amco seems happy at least. 
Oh no, yeah, no, there's the wood, wood, wood sprite. I don't remember what wood, what um, wood sounded like or grass. I forget. It's, it's either grass or wood. Was there something else you needed? There's no water in there. There's a lot we don't know about all this. I was hoping for answers. A chat would kill time better than my usual rounds, as you wish. I don't know why all you're so annoyed about us being here. Dormant for long periods, with one exception. We alternate who looks after the rest of us while we sleep. Ah, oh, so it was you this time. My sleeping friends each and every day. I woke up four years ago just as the last pilgrimage was coming through the burrow. So for four years, you've been watering these guys, waiting for them to bloom. All by yourself? Of course. Though, I guess it's not going to matter much anymore if there's no arm. Might as well hang up my watering can. You can't be out of options already. Have you talked with your patron elemental? Maybe she can help. Yeah, where is she? <laughs> what a silly thing to say. I like how the immediately the animation reset there. Course. I was like, ha ha. There's nothing I can do about this. <laughs> but how do you know if you don't try? I went directly to Sylphid and asked to be made the arm. Yeah. You don't want this place You're to very impulsive right? about it, Karina. I feel like you just basically begged them to become an arm. Go ask the elemental of wood to hurry it up. You've got to be joking. She's joking, right? Karina's telling the truth. She went out and found the elemental of wind. Yeah, why haven't you tried this? It feels like the obvious the thing to do. But, but that's going against the hand of fate. Perhaps mortals like yourself try to defy destiny, but that's not how we do things up here. Sproutlings take what life gives He did us say that you were fine with your future ending, but that doesn't sound like a very good way of living, unfortunately. Ago it was, but we watched your world teeter on the edge of destruction. All the while, we waited, tending the seeds as we've always done. Whatever hand fate deals us is our burden to bear. How egotistical to assume you know better than the goddess <laughs> We don't want to fucking die! Egotistical? That's rich coming from a stubborn way. Oh like no, Kavina's gonna hate He's him. To stick to his principles, he just needs some perspective. Is following the will of the world really worth accepting the destruction of all you hold dear? Maybe that's part of it, though. What he holds dear is the fact that mm. everything has, has its time and place, and that fate must conclude that. But also, I, I heavily disagree. Too. I don't want Jule to give up hope. Yes. If only Fairy could facilitate a conversation with our headstrong host. However, she hardly ever visits the city except to appoint an arm. <sighs> I remember the days I spent waiting near turn all by myself. At least Julie seems okay at the solitude. Oh, Catman wants to be sociable. <gasps> the more I think about it, the more it makes me mad. Me? Egotistical? It's pretty much a poet description of who you are, to be honest, Karina. Finally, someone to fight her in her beliefs. <laughs> and here's the final one we saw anyway. You're not really pouring it on the plant. Once, you know that? <laughs> what is it this time? You were the one who ran off. We weren't done with our conversation. Actually, I didn't have anything else to say to you folks. I've said my piece. No need to get worked up about it. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Karina is like two sets away show. from her from the cat opal blowing go. over. So go ahead and look around for that cork stone or, or what have you. It's core stone, not cork stone. And that's our friend Soul you're talking oh, about, Bub. Karina! Hina, the alma fire, had her core stone stolen by Oren. If we don't get that piece of her back, then Tiania is in danger. Ferdia still has a chance. So use it! How can you stand around and throw your hands up like none of this is in your control? Don't you care what happens to the burrow? Hand clank, do it. Come on, do the donkey or hand clank. Go! Isn't that worth asking to become the alm of wood yourself? Look, pal, I'm not going to take much more of your sass. Oh! I'm not <laughs> of my home. There should be blooms by now. It's Hold on. not supposed to be like this. Without flowers, the fairy won't come. Without the fairy, us sproutlings lose our purpose. Oh. No lives to preserve. It'd be the end of everything. Maybe. 
Maybe this is my fault. No! I already love this character. Don't blame yourself. Always on my mind. Here's a thought, Julie. We could all search for the reason the flowers aren't blooming. Huh? But don't you need to find that Aaron guy who stole from you? Attack a Titan reference confirmed. You yourself. No one has come through the burrow but us. We trust you to know what's going on in your home. Besides, I'm the soul guard. It's my duty to find the Alm and protect them from harm. Yeah. I like that. Look, That's good. I appreciate the thought, but there's no cure for the burrow. It's pointless. Well, we've done it before oh, with um, Molly. Stop quitting before you start, kid. Come on, folks. We've got a this is a good character art for Karina too. Like he's actually putting someone I else before this herself this time. Get enough sunlight. That's what. The landscape in Verdius hasn't changed in millennia. They would have had problems long before now if it was the sun. Maybe no. Why have you got those weird places around your tail, Molly? It's weird. It is true that Elusia is a tad far from other terrain. The solution may be that the sustenance given to the sprouts is being sucked dry. Hmm. That's a lot of leads to it eliminate. It could be those plants we were seeing Let's in the previous the area. area the, what, the monster plants. Hmm. The reason... <gasps> Wait, could it be... This character is so adorable. I love them. Where They're really good so far. Well, this is something that I wanted to, to discuss earlier. But I think it's worth talking about now when it comes to the voice acting. I... You know, as usual complaints when it comes to voice acting in this game, it's to be expected to be honest, considering it isn't rebirth levels of quality, or even Dragon Quest levels of quality, but even Dragon Quest has, has, has its issues, especially in 11 and some spots. And the main reason for that isn't the, the, necessarily the voice actors, or the directors. When it comes to, you know, Japanese RPGs being translated over, there's a translation team who do it, and there's a vocalization team as well, who work on the voice acting aspect of that. One thing that is worth noting from Xenoblade Chronicles, for example, is Harry McIntyre, the person who voices Noah in Xenoblade Chronicles 3, did not talk to the other actors at all. It wasn't like 16, where Ben Starr talked to the other actors during that development and actually had sessions with them for some times. When it comes to these smaller scale RPGs, not even from Square, but from Nintendo too with Xenoblade, they tend to not do them together hence the chemistry they have to create themselves or from the vocal director in the in the booth of them additionally they don't read it in order they don't read the story they get given certain lines every single day usually designed so that they do more the intense scenes towards the end of the day so when you have stuff like again using the harry mcintyre example he had to read like another character's dialogue, really dramatic scene, and then follow up with like a more funny scene or a standard exposition scene. And hence, when it comes to voice acting these things, not only is the difficulty in like kind of getting yourselves into the moment and getting the, all the context you need to deliver those voice lines, but you're also a lot under time constraints to deliver those lines. So when it comes to some lines feeling stilted or not entirely in tune with the scene, that's probably why. I, I don't, that's why I never complain about the voice acting, because the circumstances behind it are difficult, to say the least. We don't know. We kind of know when it comes to 16 how the voice acting was done, because there was a heavy emphasis on the voice acting. With games like this, where the translation's not less important, but not the priority, it tends to be the case where the voice acting's not as good. But, saying that, this game's voice acting is leagues better than Trials of Manor, and I actually really like what the work has been done here so far. So let's ignore that complaint. I'm not going to talk about it any anymore. I just wanted to bring that point up and my stance on the whole voice acting situation. Let's continue. Uh. Our villagers in Longwood took care of our crops and never had a green thumb. Um. Jelay mentions overwatering, but you'd think the vegetation would show signs of rot if that were the case. Unless it's down in the roots. Something else, by the way. One more thing. Pronunciations. So when it comes to these little lines of dialogue, it's something I'm trying to get better at as well. Characters will emphasize certain words to make to direct the conversation. You can just read this like blatantly, 
but like stuff like unless it's down unless it's down in the roots or unless it's unless it's down in the roots it's gonna have a different meaning entirely so that's something else that is worth noting when it comes to these things because you don't know the entire context behind it sometimes there could be a parasite polishing off the necessary nutrients in the soil or a weed consuming the water until all else withers. Annunciation it's called, I think, right? Uh, the whole area is covered in plants. No one can get through all this. Unless it was Julie. Hmm. Maybe that's for the best. We don't want Orin sneaking uh, I past think you us. can get through below the log. Unless he's the one that blocked it off. Climb around. Val, I surrender. I don't know anything about growing plants. <laughs> this foray is fascinating. Practically, I feel like Palomina might know something, considering what we're all reading. There's no getting around it. We have to ask the elemental of wood for help. They might seem Great up for idea. it. They seem like they were up for it before. Doesn't know what's wrong. No one will. Oh, oh, not Julie. Sorry, yeah, like the, the elemental of wood. Face when we found the answer. Sorry to disappoint you, Karina, but we haven't got the time to waste on fumbling around in the undergrowth. Dryad is the elemental of wood and well versed of these wilds. But who can say where we may find her? Would we should have asked Gnome. At times like these, it's best to ask the locals. Ugh, great. Gotta bother Jule again. <laughs> she really Sorry. hates him. Poor little guy. Huh? It can't be. Oh my god, here they are. How'd they get up the vine? They followed us from behind. I guess they have some like combat experience, maybe. Okay, no oh, meowing. Don't you know there's a know there stock that reaches all the way up here? My sisters and I didn't want to waste this once in four years opportunity, so we climbed up. We figured now is the perfect chance to gather exotic ingredients like verdius nectar for flavorings and potions. Yes, so adorable. Besides, this place has everything: ancient forests, dangerous pilgrimages, mysterious Gaian explorers. Wait, what? What's you mean it's mysterious, mysterious guy and ex uh, explorers? Have a full itinerary. Wait a minute. Did you say guy and explorers? What? Where did we you should have told those? them to beat them up oh, if they saw one. There was a dashing young adventurer of that description over by the tree. We saw him ahead of us. Oh! We did lose track of him though. He did climb the vine. On keeping our footing and all. <sighs> Oren's on his way. Mm -hmm. Did you see a sproutling around here? Short, green, leafy. <laughs> Good description, Morley. Sure Excellent job. You fucking idiot. Uh, I love you. <laughs> what the hell was that? Uh, what was that? A terrifying cry, that's what. It came from the direction of Milo's woods. Oh, there so was a boss arena trouble? we walked past to get here. Could be Jule. That must Warren be it. Orin. Let's check it out. I don't oh, think that was Owen making that noise, know. but I know what you're talking about. It wasn't they weren't talking about the noise, they're talking about they might be in trouble. Chance. I mean, I mean, if Owen's in trouble, great. For a price. Grab the goods you need to save your friend. Don't get stingy now. You. Bye, bye, bye. You. They're the spitting image of father in miniature. They're so small. That cry was coming from Milo. The fire you didn't become a merchant, Morley. Oh shit! You do have new weapons. Everything. Oh, you actual great little. Guys, oh, it's gonna be so expensive. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna get that because I'm never gonna use his weapons. Get this. Get this. Get this. Yeah, we have to get each one for, for uh, Palomina. <laughs> well, that gear I'm not holding currently. Wait, 
Wait, then that's a Sukum's really that bad in this game? Not a big fan of this setting system. It's awkward. Right, there we go. You little rascal. All these goods are the great go. Thank you for your purchase. Oh, it was you who got that item. I fought flower suit. Hello. You. You, Morley. It was you. It was always you. Not that expensive either. You want find things from your business? You want things from your business? You want find things from your business? <laughs> I'm leaving. Oh, I'm broke. I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed the fact I won't be able to go to Manic Tree this episode, but it's fine. I'll save that until tomorrow. I can wait. Oh shit. Oh, it's just like Evil Forest from 9. It's gonna have the. It's gonna like eat him and then he's gonna be in a cage. Oh, little guy. I love how much of a little shit he is. He's great. So adorable. to nest near the burrow. Be careful. It's coming for us. Get ready, everyone. Win the battle. Oh, stop with your puns. Well, I'm going for the core. Okay, we need to get through here about the touch of the pot fog. Good damage, uh, Palomina. Oh wait, you poisoned? Good use of the fucking uh, moon, you idiot. Oh, hello. The music's good here. Molly, stop dying. Oh, I know, I know, I know, no, 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 to me, to you. Oh, come on. I'm sorry. No, I don't, I'm sorry. Camera's not having a good time right now. Oh, the camera. Oh, the camera. The camera's all right. It's all right, camera. It's all right. It's all right. Trying to hit his head. He aimed for his head! Oh, not being able to choose is annoying. Oh, you're being a penis. Oh, shit! The camera, the camera, the camera. Okay, go, go, go! I didn't use my EXP increase, I just realized. 
Gnome Stravel. I really like this form for Palomina. It's very useful. <gasps> defeat it within 40 seconds. I didn't defeat it within 40 seconds. Or oh, one minute and 40 you seconds. Okay. Me. Thanks. Uh. It was a close call. We were almost too late. Why did you wander off on your own? Oh wait, you don't wear shoes? Okay, if you become armor, it's gonna be an issue. It's like, like a hobbit, and your feet don't really matter that much. I mean, that you made me wonder if Grappelwine might be the cause of the problems in the burrow. Don't get me wrong, this could all still be by the goddess's will, but I wasn't quite as sure. And well, so you've got flowering on you. And you all seem so convinced that something could be done, so... I wanted to check, but then I got attacked. Huh, and here I thought you were mad at us again. Glad to see we've convinced you to change your stubborn ways. That's... one way to put it. Destiny doesn't just fall into your lap every time. Maybe. But you weren't able to figure out what keeps the flowers from blooming either, right? <laughs> yeah, we're definitely not experts in gardening. Speak for yourself. But when in doubt, it's best to ask for help. Julie. Do you know where the elemental of wood is? <laughs> Dryad? Easy peasy. Let me give her a ring. Oh my god. Wait, what do you mean ring? Uh, Telephones don't exist in this world! Oh. oh, there she is. Oh, yes. Um, hello. Jeepers. Oh, she's so adorable. Fast. Were you nearby? Oh, forgive me. That is to say, I was looking for you, Julie. Nah, I see she is shy. That's her character trait. Okay. Oh dear, the elves. Please excuse me. I am known as Dryad. A particular pleasure indeed, Dryad. We were just inquiring as to your whereabouts. Yes, I could hear you from over there, and I think I may know what caused all of this fuss. As Julie guess. Grapplevine was the one behind it all. It absorbed all the nutrients from the plants, stunting their growth. That's why the flowers wouldn't blossom. Well, the monster is gone now. So that means... The flowers, my friends. Dryad, this is great. There'll be an alm after all. Mm-hmm. We can expect the blooms at any moment. It's Jeez, gonna happen on him, isn't it? There's still so much to do. I have to get ready to welcome the fairy. Meet you back in Verdius. He's got some spring in his step now. Could I ask you, Alms, and you, Sir Soulguard, to join Julie? Sure. Irregular as this situation may be, you will be one of the few pilgrimages to see the flowering firsthand. That should It's gonna be lovely. Well, he has to see some flowers. I have a feeling he's going to be the one to bloom, and he's gonna be. We, I, we saw the intro. I feel like the intro spoiled this. Because the intro shows the four of them walking towards the tree. And he wouldn't do that unless he was an arm. I guess he gets grouchy when he's worried. Lucky for us. For now, let's head to the appointment ceremony of the Alm of Wood. What? What? I just wanted to talk to you, Morley. Eli appears to have quite a relaxed relationship with his patron hit elemental. Hmm. Lucky, yes. Can't wait to see what kind of flowers bloom out of these guys. I mean, I'd assume being these like seedlings is a very, a, a very boring job. Like you'd be for like you'd be you'd be alive for like four years. You go to sleep for four years, and then you're woken up like I don't know twenty years later. Like you're only on your own. It's kind of sad. Yes. I am heartened that we could be of help to the bar. Anything to see this pilgrimage through. Hmm. I sense a butt coming up soon, but not now. Oh, is it this one? Maybe it isn't going to be him. Dryad, come on. Shake a root. <laughs> Again. I need to find out who this voice actor is because they're doing an excellent job. future and consulting with the denizens of the woods and such. <sighs> now then, let me see. With this spring I can't see it right now. I'm losing my mind. Oh, they've undone this and, and Genshin Impact. Only two rolls. <gasps> it's him! He's got a little flower! How 
unexpected. No flowers on the sleeping trees, but a flower blossoming right out of your head. What the hell? Blossoming sproutling Julie. That must have like really hurt. <laughs> Like, he just pulled hair from him. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. It's better be like sentimental, but he just like came over, pulled a limb from his body, and then like, mm, this smells delicious. It's not like a hand or something. He's still a child. I thought only dormant sproutlings were fated to blossom. Oh, yes, well, you see. I was planning to choose you from the very beginning. That's why I went searching for you. <laughs> I like. I want to see you get sacrificed. And fulfill the duty of the old it's kind of sucks for the triad because he doesn't even get <laughs> to go on a journey. Triad. He just has to sit here for four years. Oh, well, not a triad. Not a triad. The ceiling. They just sit here for four years and wait until they're chosen and they go off and die. What the fuck? I can't leave them alone like that, Dryad. Yeah, exactly. Be worse than any well, maybe, maybe they will be fine the once you can do this and someone else will take your place. Jule? Huh? Come to us. We have a message for you. Wait, that's... Jule? What's wrong? I can hear my friends. They want to tell me something. Come on, let's go talk to them. I didn't notice anything. Oh, great. Dryad's here. Jule could hear the voices of his friends. Better stick with him and check oh, this out. Okay, I've got to do his voice now. Huh? That's one more arm in the party. Time to make like a tree and leaf. Oh, my God. Hmm. The trees around us all seem to be rejoicing at the appointment of the arm. The restless rustling has relented a bit already. Hmm. There's a chance for July. He just needs the time to think. Oh my, um, the fairy has already departed. She never has time to linger, I fear. Okay. Okay. My friends are calling to me. Will you come with and see what they have to say? That's the best I can do. <laughs> it's fine. I can do higher pitch voices and lower pitch voices for the most part, so... I can at least get closer to his voice than others. Your joyful singing. We asked Dryad to choose you as the arm on our behalf. Because we all hate you. That monster in Bible's woods has been draining us of our mana. We have nothing to spare on our buds. Grapplevine is defeated, but it will take time before we can bloom again. Too much time to avoid the destruction of the burrow. But what will you do without a custodian? You'll dry up. <laughs> Don't worry about us. Things will work out. Believe in the future of the burrow. We need you to convey the wishes of the Sproutlings to the mana tree. But you've all waited so long for the chance to be an alm. I can't take that honor away. Then use this, and together we will see the future flourish. Wowie, the elemental vessel, Dryad Sprig. Is that, is that the elemental vessel? No! Oh dear. So that's Destroy it! I can't have this as well right now. He's already got to have five interviews. I want to do fucking ten interviews. I think it's time to go back to sleep. Oh yeah. Oh okay. <laughs> I can't believe this. This is fucked. This entire situation is fucked. Take the words of encouragement from your countrymen to heart. You're lucky they can see you off on your journey. They can't see you off on your there journey. No it's not even a journey. You're going like five feet. Wish me luck when I left You're walking up to the mana tree and it's going to suck your life force and then it's over. A chance at bringing some life back to the parish if I complete the alms duty. That's my hope, at least. Molly's right. It oh. been nice no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm with Orem now, Orem's, I'm with Orem. Work out like that. Everyone at home always told me I wasn't fit to be an Elm. 
But this journey has given me a lot to think about now that I'm here. And this from the person lecturing me about alms and duties just a moment ago. Hmm. Huh. Sounds like the pilgrimage hasn't been easy so far. So adorable. Thanks for putting up with me earlier. I look forward to our journey together. As short as it is. The mana tree is just over there, after all. Happy to have you, Jule. Oh, what are we going to do about the greenery blocking our way out? I birds? assume that Jule can deal with it. Um, I apologize. That was my doing. Yeah, but all of them can get there. So leave out, leave it closed. No one's gonna like run past us like ah suckers! No, no, no! Jule can be an oddball at times, but he is an invaluable ally who offers healing and support to his teammates. He can even learn how to revive fallen allies. However, be aware that his naturally low defense makes him unfit for engaging directly with enemies. People are beckoning for soothing powers in nature. Okay, healing. Okay, it's healing. Okay, I see. I shouldn't get ahead of myself. Yeah, we're not or there to sacrifice there. them right now. Whatever I can do to prepare, I should do it in the burrow. That's probably where we're going to leave it too. Okay. I'm ready to face my fate with the burrow and all my friends. Hmm. It is time to set forth for the tree of mana. Strange that we have had no hint of uh, uh, Aaron since his arrival. Right. We're on a mission we all want to believe in. I don't know if I want to believe in it. <sighs> there are spouts can rest easy and July has us to re 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 rely on it. July has us to rely on for a change. Yeah, that was a weird way of saying that. Oh yeah, we can now do something with this. Well, with that, I, I don't know if we can do any experimentation right now considering Power. we're going into a big place. But, next time, we'll do some experimenting. Maybe not if we go straight to the Tree of Mana, but we'll see. Might be an area before there. I kind of hope there is an area before there. But yeah, that's it for now. I'll see you next time, now that we have Jalei on our menu. Everyone's here now. Yeah. I'll see you all for that. Goodbye.